Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Elizabeth Davis, if you're new. I make a lot of fashion videos and lifestyle vlogs, so if that's your vibe, then definitely subscribe. I recently just returned from my social media break and I'm so excited to get back to it. And I decided to start things off with a spring cleaning video. And I do keep my apartment clean for the most part, but I wanted to kind of walk through with you guys how I do each thing. I usually start off by doing one room at a time. And I usually pick one room and get that done and then I take a break until like the next day. Like I don't clean the whole apartment at once usually. Like I'm, I'll pick up if I have things sitting around, but I don't do any kind of deep cleaning. Or I'll pick like one chore and get it done through the day. Like you'll see in the vlog, I did sweeping and mopping all in one day. And then like another day I wiped down all my surfaces. So it just depends on what needs done and in what room that I do it. So I just wanted to kind of let you guys know what the format of the video is going to be. So if you like cleaning videos and you like productive vlogs, go ahead and hit the like button, subscribe if you are not subscribed and please return for more. So you hit that notification bell so you don't miss any other videos from me. So let's just hop right into it. We're gonna start off by cleaning my bedroom and it's gonna be all B-roll. I was really not in the mood to even show my face that was like the first day back of filming and I was like, oh my gosh, I am not really prepared. So, but I did need to clean my room and I wanted to do that with you guys. So we're gonna go ahead and jump into that and then I hope you guys enjoy the vlog. Okay, so I finished cleaning and here's the result. I still need to sweep, but I was laying in my bed so it's a little messed up, but I think it looks pretty good. It's been a while since I've cleaned my room. <laughs> this is my childhood stuffed animal. He's really old and kind of dirty. <laughs> um, his name's Bunny. Here's the back side of him. He's like slowly coming apart so I might have to put a patch over him at some point but uh, this is from Amazon and I really like it I like like that I have so much storage for my jewelry which I don't have very much jewelry right now but and it's a mirror but it doesn't stay shut <sighs> it's so annoying so I need to find like a new magnet or something on Amazon for it but it was kind of expensive. It was over $100 and I haven't even had it that long and it already won't. Oh, well, I guess if you just push it shut 500 times, it'll finally go closed, but it doesn't stay shut. It's like a recurrent problem. So I need to find some better magnets, but yeah, I think it looks pretty cute in here. I just hung up all this stuff my parents did a few days ago and hopefully one day soon I'll get to update my bedding. But yeah, it's nice and clean now. Hi guys, it's another day now. It's uh, two days later, three days later, and I'm gonna be cleaning my kitchen as soon as I log off of work here, and it's almost the end of the day. I wanted to 
do my dishes with you guys. I have a lot of dishes. I've been staying home a lot and like eating at home a lot. So my sink is really full even though I just did my dishes like four days ago, maybe five. I don't have a dishwasher so I have to do them all by hand and it takes me some time. So I have to like carve out time to do my dishes like once or twice a week and like it just seems like I have more than usual today. So I'm gonna be doing that as soon as I log off of work. And then I was thinking that I would just go ahead and scrub my floors since I'm gonna be cleaning my kitchen and like my table needs cleaned off because I got home late kind of last night and I just set my stuff that I had on my table and just went to sleep. I was really tired. So definitely gonna be picking that up today. And that's pretty much it. Nothing too exciting, but I wanted to let you guys know what was going on because I do want this to be more of like a deep cleaning vlog, but also I have to keep up with my day to day chores so it's a little bit of both it's basically just like a productive get my life together vlog and trying to get back into the swing of things after being lazy all winter so hope you guys are enjoying so far give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying this video so i know to continue making productive vlogs i like watching productive vlogs because i like a little bit of motivation for myself so if that's your thing go ahead and give this video a thumbs up so i know and then i'll make some more for you Quick little side note, I, for cleaning my dishes, I just use this Ajax dish soap. I get it from the Dollar Tree, it's literally $1.25. I prefer Dawn dish soap, but I don't think they have it at my Dollar Tree. Um, and anyway, it's more expensive, even if they did, so I probably wouldn't get as big of a bottle. And I think that this does a pretty decent job. Um, so far I haven't had any trouble getting anything off of my dishes. And then after i well usually before i spray my counter with this meyer all surface spray um i just this one is the basil scent it's, i think my grandma got this for me at target and then i just put down a towel for my dishes to dry on i don't have like a drying rack or anything i don't really see the need for one other than the fact that it would just take up space so um I just use a towel and then once it once all the dishes dry I just put them away I'm sorry I would lift you guys up but I know this tripod is just gonna collapse so I'm just gonna go ahead and lean down <laughs> it actually kind of annoys me when people lean down and talk into the camera instead of raising it up but I cannot with this tripod it does not want to go up or down it just stays the way it is <laughs> or it goes all the way to the floor so sorry that I'm bending down like you're a child but <laughs> some of you might be um, and then for like scrubbing, I got this little scouring sponge. I think it came in a pack of a few, like three or four of them. And um, I got it at the dollar store, Dollar General, I believe. So, I mean, I just use pretty basic cleaning products. I don't really like go into all the fancy stuff except for the Meyer spray because I really like the way it smells and also when it comes to sprays and chemical products instead of soap products, I tend to break out in hives. So I try to use like more of a natural product, but that's about it as far as fanciness gets. Like when it comes to the way I do my dishes, it's pretty much like a hillbilly, like really old fashioned, you know, like in the olden days. So I have a ton of dishes, so I'm gonna stop running my mouth and do them because there's a lot.
now I'm gonna sweep and mop the Swiffer floor wipes and then my mop. So I'm just gonna stick one on here uh, after I sweep and then I will attach the Swiffer or I will Swiffer the room. I decided I'm gonna go ahead and do the bathroom too. I just did the hallway and bathroom last week as well as the kitchen, but since I'm gonna mop the floor, um, which I planned to do last week, I just didn't get around to. But since I'm gonna mop all the floors, I figure just get it all done at once and go ahead and sweep it too. That way there's not as much like dust to pick up on the mop and also it won't spread the dust as much because I'll already have swept it. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm tired. Um, just finished sweeping. And now that I have that done, I'm gonna raise the tripod up. Anyway, I just swept the whole apartment, except my office. I'm gonna get to that later. Um, I still have some other things that I'm trying to do in there, so sweeping is, I actually like to get my mom's sweeper over here for that room because, <sighs> I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's like, because I play with my hair while I work, but there's like so much hair on the floor. This is gross, but I have really thick hair and it does like shed a lot like a dog. And it's like really hard to sweep up with my little sweeper. It's not very good with carpet and rugs. Like it's my rug in my living room, it's okay. But like my bedroom and my office does not seem to really want to like get everything up out of the carpet. So I'm thinking about asking my parents if they'll let me borrow their sweeper one day so that I can like get a good sweep in my bedroom and office without having to go over and over and over it and like pick up clumps of stuff off the floor that's like the sweeper should be able to get, you know what I mean? So now I'm going to go ahead and sweep her. I'm excited for that. done. It didn't actually take long at all, but um, let's see what the bottom of this looks like. The other one was really bad. I had to change it. I forgot to show you guys. I think I put it on backwards. I don't know. For reference, here's the other side. Pretty gross. The other one was like 10 times worse, if you can believe it. So I'm done scrubbing, done cleaning for today. Um, next time I have, I have a little list on my phone in my Notion. I use Notion a lot for organizing my life, really, like lists and cleaning and video ideas and all of that kind of thing. So I made a list of other things I need to do. So I'm going to look at that and figure out what else we'll be doing later this week but as of today i'm done so see you guys next time i decide to clean good morning it is saturday i had a really crazy work week so i have not finished my spring cleaning but today's the day it's march 4th i can't believe it's march 4th already that's so crazy like i have not thought about youtube or really social media at all because work has been so busy so it should be slowing down now, but it is also the weekend, so I'm gonna take advantage of this time and finish up cleaning. Um, today, I am going to clean off my glass surfaces and pick up my living room. It's just kind of messy from being busy this week, and I just kind of 
didn't like keep things organized. So I'm gonna organize a little bit, pick up and then spray off all of my glass surfaces, which includes my end tables on my couch or beside my couch. And then all of my mirrors, which I'm pretty sure the bathroom mirror and like this mirror over here are the only ones that need it. I don't think my bedroom mirrors need it, but we'll see. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I thought about dusting my shelves too, but I realized this morning while I was planning out the rest of my cleaning that I don't have any dusting solution, like any pledge or anything like that. Um, so I'm gonna have to maybe improvise a little bit, see how that goes, because I don't wanna just dust with like nothing. <laughs> this is my favorite glass cleaner. This stuff is literally a miracle worker when it comes to cleaning glass. I first of all, suck at cleaning glass, but this is my helper and it takes all of the sins away on a glass. So, on a glass surface or mirror. And I just use paper towels, so I'll just spray my tables and my mirror and wipe it off and then we're good to go. It's pretty simple, it gets it done really quickly and let's get started. But one last point here, I'm going to watch a YouTube video while I clean. Probably Tiffany Jetter because she is one of my friends here on YouTube. She's so awesome. I love her so much. Um, and her vlogs are so good. And I just found a sprinkle on the floor. Wow. This was from my donut that I should not have eaten the other day. And I remember dropping it and I was like, I can't find it. I can't find it. And I thought, well, maybe I didn't drop it. Well, I just found it. I stepped on it and there it is. So anyway, uh, Tiffany Jetter, she's one of my awesome, awesome friends here on YouTube. She is a lifestyle vlogger. Um, I'm not sure if that's how she'd classify herself. So forgive me, Tiffany, if that's not the right way to describe your videos, but she does make a lot of like cleaning videos, organization, Dollar Tree hauls, Walmart hauls. She's really cool. I love her. She's just so authentic and genuine. So I highly recommend checking out her videos. I'll link her channel in my description box so you guys can just click on it. You don't have to like search for her. Um, but Tiffany Jetter, she's super awesome. Shout out to Tiffany. kind of hard to see on camera but there's a ton of watermarks these are from my other mirror but yeah okay so you can see it like this I'm throwing these away yeah so this needs clean for sure 
I've been meaning to clean it for like three or four days, but like I said, work was crazy. So I'm just gonna clean this real quick. I don't really have a place to set my phone while I film this, but I'll show you when it's done. Oh, I'm gonna do a little impromptu bathroom cleaning because <laughs> when I was wiping my mirror, I realized like my sink kind of needs wiped again. Like I did it like a week and a half ago, but I spent a lot of time in the bathroom doing makeup and skincare and just bathrooms just already are gross. So I'm gonna just, I'm just gonna scrub it real quick and then that's probably all I'm gonna do for now. Oh, my coffee table needs wiped off. I really need to go get some dusting solution because my shelves are like really dusty. I was hoping they weren't, but I like swiped my finger over it and I, they need wiped off. So gotta figure a way out to do that. My living room looks so good. I'm so pleased. It's just so relaxing now. Since I wiped off everything, like the mirrors and the end tables. Looks great. I really think that there's something to it when it comes to your apartment and your space where you live being clean. I feel like every time I clean my apartment, um, it's just so relaxing and it just makes me feel like productive and like I did something so I also enjoy making videos like this sometimes it can be a lot of work when I'm cleaning but this time it was pretty easy I actually was surprised how smooth it went so I definitely I didn't want to make this video too long but I have a lot more of projects that I want to get done like I want to organize my makeup and my jewelry and my perfume and just do like a closet clean out some more like organization type things and then I also have some deep cleaning I want to do I did the floors but I also want to do like I still didn't dust my shelves and that's going to be really intricate because I have so many little tchotchkes on every shelf so it's going to take me some time to do that and then I was also thinking about scrubbing down my kitchen cabinets and then there was a couple other things I wanted to do. So if you guys wanna see a part two and maybe even a part three of this spring cleaning, get your life together video, hit the like button and leave a comment down below. Also, if you're new, please, please, please subscribe, hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos. And I will see you all in my next one. Adios.